Hello nail art fans, today I'm going to show you a gender revealed nail art design. Apologies for the wobbly start, first thing I'm doing is applying two coats of white gel polish and curing. Next using a fine detail brush and pale blue gel polish, painting the shape of a heart. Once you have the shape of your heart, fill in around the heart shape with the pale blue gel polish and cure. You can use a larger brush if you want to, to fill in the colour. Next you're going to use nude nail polish to paint the shape of the baby's head. I have actually mixed mine with a little bit of pink polish and a little bit of white just to make it that bit paler and more skin toned. Once you're happy with the baby's head, cure it and then you can't smudge it. Then move on to your baby grow and baby's body. Um, so this is going to, going to be using the same pale blue and I'm painting in just a little bit of the baby grow because you're not going to be able to see all of it because of the bottle of milk that the baby will be holding. I am leaving the collar white. So firstly I'm using white to paint in the shape of the baby's bottle. Then once I've done that I cure and add a clear gel top coat, cure that and then buff it. I need to buff it because I'm using gel polishes as opposed to gel paints and they do need a buff surface to be applied to. Now you need to add the colour to the bottle, so I'm using a yellow gel polish and a blue gel polish, the same one that I used last time, however I have added a little bit of dark blue just to give it a little bit more colour. Then use the same colour of blue for the, as you've used for the bottle on the baby grow to outline the arms and define the colour. When I'm doing designs like this, I usually break them down into shapes first and foremost, then I paint in the block colours and then I start to add the detail, the shading and the outlines. To outline the head, I'm using black mixed with some of the nude. This is just to tone down the colour a little bit. Use light feathery techniques to paint the hair. You also want your outline to be as fine as possible. Use the same colour to create the eyes and the nose and the mouth. Next use a little bit of pink polish mixed with clear gel top coat to create the cheeks. Gel polishes can be more watery than gel paints and therefore it can sometimes be hard to get a very defined line or painting. So what's best to do is put them out on a plastic palette or on the back of a nail form and let the solvent evaporate a little bit at room temperature just before you use them. Once you've finished the details of the baby, add hearts to the white heart area with blue gel polish and then white dots to the blue area with the white gel polish. Cure and then add your dark blue outline to the heart. If you find that your line isn't thin enough or defined enough, you can clean it up with a clean brush and just go around and tidy it up before you cure it. And finally to finish, I'm adding a little bit of white to the eyes and to parts of the design just to highlight it and a little bit of extra shading where I feel it needs it. Thank you. 
Once you're happy with your design, cure completely and then apply a clear gel top coat and cure that. And there you have it, the perfect gender reveal design for a boy. Please remember to subscribe, hit the like button and drop me a comment below. Thank you for watching and stay tuned for the next video which will be a gender reveal for a girl.